From the station working for you, this is an RTV6 update. I'm Lauren Casey and these are your latest headlines from the RTV6 newsroom. First responders on the Atlantic coast will have some help from Indiana soon. More than 80 members of Indiana Task Force 1 left on Tuesday morning heading for their staging area in Raleigh, North Carolina. That's where they'll wait for their assignments from FEMA to help with any needs related to the hurricane. Task Force 1 Indiana helped following the 9-11 terror attacks. A team was deployed back in 2001 to assist first responders on the ground. This is file video from that time. They're, they're searching through the rubble and debris, searching for any signs of life. Crews were assigned to help with rescue and recovery efforts. Let's get a check of our forecast now with Todd Claussen. And Lauren, finally some good news in the forecast as we have gotten rid of the clouds and the rain. Partly cloudy skies here this afternoon as we work more and more in the way of sunshine and temperatures will warm into the upper 70s off to the west, mid 70s here through the metro area and then low 70s as you make your way off to the eastern portion of the state. But here's the better news as we look at our rain chances the next four days. There are none. We got a great opportunity to dry out with lots of sunshine heading our way, so we will certainly welcome that across the area. If you do have plans this evening, keep in mind sunset is right at 8 o'clock this evening. As we go throughout the evening, temperatures will fall back down into the 60s, and then by tomorrow morning, you'll be waking up to temperatures in the 50s. Todd, thank you. For more stories and weather you need to know, you can download the RTV6 mobile app. Thanks for joining us.